yeah, this update might end up being delayed. As you guys can see here, that most people voted for the big update, which is going to take longer time anyway. But it's going to probably take even longer time. It says here, it will be a while before Nuba returns, around four weeks, and still takes time to build the map. And I know that. It takes time to build a map, I'm telling you. Unless you're coming home from school, or if you don't have school, you just hop on the computer as soon as you wake up. And you're just straight up building the whole day it's gonna take you time it still takes time to build the map after that so we cannot proceed with the inside update that was originally planned i understand this is disappointing but i don't want to keep everyone waiting since it's already been a month we'll release some game content and adjust the roadmap initial plans slightly please feel free to suggest any in-game content or quality of life improvements in the suggestion sections focusing primarily on pvp based content that doesn't require any map changes DW, well don't worry, we'll release some codes for compensation as well. So we're going to get new codes and we're probably still going to get an update, just not in terms of the map. Which means we can get something like a new skill or, you know, just stuff like that. Things that don't require a map. Uh, if you guys want to have suggestions, like, you know, tell me any suggestions, that will be cool. Now, my suggestion for the game, actually, I'll have to think about that because I haven't read the actual message yet since he's asking for suggestions. Wait, hold up. Does does Oscar have a rank mode? I don't think Oscar has a rank. Now, Oscar can add a rank mode and you can get Oscar oil, bro. I'm telling you, that'll be a W, bro. That will have, probably have people playing the game more. Probably add codes that give you Oscar coins as well. Another game that does this is Mighty Omega, for example. They give MC coins or whatever you want to call it in their codes sometimes. And I don't know if there's a rank mode in Mighty. I know they have like, I think they do have some kind of mode where you can go into and fight. I think there's a, isn't there a tournament mode in Oscar? Yeah, I don't know. All I know is that when I hop in there, it says play or whatever private servers i think there's another box too though but if there's no rank mode they should definitely add ranked uh even if there is one i don't think the rewards give you oscar coins i feel like they should add that that would be very nice and i feel like people will want to play more because they can get these clan spins and stuff because everyone's trying to get you know Senko or curry they should definitely add more clans definitely add more rare clans because when you hop in the server, even though it's a 1% chance to get these clans, almost, you see so many people with it. And there's only two clans, so it's like, if you get Kure, it's like everyone else already has it. If you get Senko, almost everyone already has it. You know, I feel like there should be more rare clans and things to choose from, you know? Um, game might have to update more frequently, maybe. I know it's hard and we all have lives and stuff, but in order to keep people entertained, I feel like the content should be more, at least during the updates. Because you got to realize if we wait in a couple of months or, you know, or a month or two, definitely should have good content in it. Um, let me see. Another thing they could add is, well, we can't, they can't do anything with the map. I feel like once they get a bigger map, they will probably add more bosses and things like that around the map. But currently, we just got to work with what we have right now. I feel like, oh, one thing that I do know, the uh, accessory shop. I feel like there should be more accessories every hour. We'll wait a whole hour. No, no, not an hour. We'll wait a day just to get like three basic attainable items and then like a Robux item. I feel like there should be more items, not gonna lie. More things to choose from, uh, more accessories. Um, they do have a lot of accessories though, don't get me wrong. So more accessories is not a must, but I definitely feel that there should be more stuff in the accessory shop. Now, I'm going to actually go into suggestions and read some of you guys' suggestions. Check that out. Alright, so here... Are they asking questions and suggestions? So they're saying rework combat. Dang, reworking combat is probably going to be a lot of work. They want more content. That's what I'm saying. They want more content, bro. They want skateboards, bikes, stuff like that. A real event calendar. Oh, so they want a calendar? Okay, that's nice. All right, that's crazy. Okay. Um. All right. Combat that's actually like the anime. Hmm. A fast base. Wait, hold up. Okay, I just watched some of Kenji and Shura fights, and I think I know what the new combat should be like. A fast paced combat with weaves that can also perfect dodge. Huh. I feel like the combat is pretty good as it is, not gonna lie. I feel like 
you know, when there's an anime and then you have like a game for it, unless you're making like a PS4 game or something, you could actually imitate that combat. I mean, well, basically like copy it. But I don't know. Maybe you can. Maybe you can make it more like the anime. I don't know. Rebirths? Oh, no. No rebirths. Let's look at the comments. Yeah, bro. Real World Fan, like, S plus crazy. The scat stick, like, bro, the buff that you get for a rebirth gotta be crazy. It gotta be crazy. Because a rebirth is, oh no. <laughs> for, bro. Exactly. And there's gonna be them, they, if they add a stat, if they add a rebirth, there gotta be a cap. Because there's gonna be those one people that's gonna be having, like, a bunch of rebirths for no reason, bro. <laughs> Alright. They, yeah, they want, they want scooters and bikes. I actually was thinking about that when I saw uh they had like a bike rack in Mighty Omega. I was thinking back then like, oh yeah, bikes would be hard in a fighting game, you know? I'd be hard. You could ride around with your friends and stuff. Especially once they get a bigger map. Bikes and scooters would be a W, I'm telling you. I feel like, not gonna lie, I feel like they should have more codes. At least like a code a week. I don't think we get a code a week in Osiris. I feel like if there's not gonna be no updates frequently, like, you know, every week or whatever or a month, I feel like we should definitely get codes every week. Definitely. It doesn't have to be toward a specific product. It could be Oscar coins. It could be a face reroll thing. You know, stuff that people vote for in the community. It'll have it more interactive. It'll probably keep the players, you know, because a lot of people, they probably spend a bunch of money on the game. They don't end up getting what they want. They feel like they got scammed and hop off. You don't want people to feel that way, you know. Uh, rework for top 10 games. I mean rewards. Oops. Definitely. They should definitely get rewards, not gonna lie. Cause to even get a top gang is an accomplishment and rewards for that would be a W. This is also something I'll probably keep people playing the game. Gang based rework. So the game based system in the game right now is the dumbest I ever seen in my life. A single person could just take the game base and stop like 15 people. <sighs> well, and the anime, say if you're very OP, like you're a very strong person. And there, there's a gang base. And there's like 20 people in there. If you're very strong, you might be able to take that base from them. So, I wouldn't call it dumbest. You know, he got a lot of likes on this. But I wouldn't call that dumbest. That's just how it is. Like, if you're just strong. Hey, one person gets 15 people. I don't know what they TP is, but dang. I don't know, man. Now, if it's like 15 F ranks going against an A rank or something or an S rank, then I can understand in a way. But, bro, that's kind of crazy. I'm not going to lie. Add a B style. Adding the styles, you know, that's pretty cool. That doesn't do anything with the map, so that's good. Um, Add B style. And the requirements would be beat the bear that was teased a while ago. That could be an idea that I think would be great. Also, add advanced styles that require, I don't know what that say. Much more stats. Maybe like B style form formless etc. Okay, now these things it's kind of like in the future. I feel it for advanced styles. Raise stat scaling after 2K. Well, here's the thing: after you get 2K, that's like end game. You know, if they uh make it higher, then people are gonna be grinding for a lot longer. So the quality of life, you know, this is a quality of life comment. You know, that's gonna make it harder for the players. You know, let's look at the comments. Oh, no one said nothing. Yeah, you know, I don't know about that. I'm not gonna lie. Good suggestion, though, no, but... Alright, this is great. self ex <laughs> Cinematic mode, definitely. For the YouTubers, we definitely need cinematic mode for the uh, thumbnails. Also, for people that just want to take... You know, because the game look heat. The accessories, all that. Yes, the thumbnails and all that. The picture screenshots, you know, make you a little banner in the background or something. It look definitely hard. Make Kung Fu style. Don't they already have Kung Fu? I'm not sure. Creatine... Water, our right, first off, creatine is bad in real life. Hey, I mean, this is a game, though, so creatine probably wouldn't be that bad. Water, that would be pretty nice, too. We definitely need more clans. Two 1% clans is too hard to get. I spent 50k on Oscar coins. I'm at 50k Oscar coins to get a clan, but I got nothing. If you could please make three more clans, that's 5%. I feel like there should be a clan probably in between. Even if they want to, they can make a 0.5 clan. Just don't make it too much stronger than the 1% clan. Give codes right now and add an update soon. It doesn't have to be big, but something that really keeps us busy waiting. They want content. They want more clans. That's what I'm saying. 
Pickle Ray boss? That's Baki, you know? I think they only stay in Strictly, though. Uh, Asura. Now, if they do add other animes, that's fire. That'll be, that'll be crazy. Counters? That would be nice if they had counters. Where's the Seek Peak? Huh? Sneak Peak? Playing hours times. They want hour times. There should be an update where you can see our playing time so that we can know how close we are to be able to have 10 million yen in the bank. I can see that. But yeah, I see. I see, I see. That's pretty cool. Console support. Make it for console can play, but you need keyboard. Okay. Police system. That would be fire if they had a police system, but once they get a bigger map. At the moment, the map isn't as big. I feel like they would probably need a bigger map for the police system. They also have to have a police building made to even begin with. They want to update. <laughs> Valentine's Code, you know, that's... How far did I go back? How Valentine's was, a, was like a couple of days ago, like a week? He said this four hours ago. Wait, huh? Posted Wednesday. Oh, he posted it February 14th. It must have been the last comment was four hours ago. Buff Honor 1, remove XP curve? No. No. Actually, game's dying because there's nothing for the noobs. Make it easier for them. Actually, yeah, definitely make it easier. Because, I'm not going to lie. People play these games to fight. And, you know, have fun. Run around. You know, take the game base. You know, do fun stuff. Grinding for, like, months. And you could finally PvP. Bro, you need the strength first off to even make it that far. To continue playing the game. And you gotta do jobs. Bro, you need the strength to even make it that far. And once you get there, you might or might not enjoy the combat. You might run into people that's like too strong. I still run into people that kill me almost instantly. Back then, I was around like C rank or whatever. I was, it seemed like I was going crazy. I get A rank and there's people just beating me up easily. Man, fat and muscle loss. Please add fat and muscle. Reset and make it like 300 to 500 Robux. They feel annoying to lose. They, they could do that. Or do like some kind of cardio machine or something. Actually, wait, you can lose. Oh, yeah, he says annoying. They got to make a faster way to probably, you know, make you lose it or whatever. Game base. More bags. More safe above game base. Move safe above game base. Why would you really need safe above game base stuff? Thug shake emote. All right, bro, you got it. Fight club. Make glowing markings obtainable through marking color reroll. Hmm, maybe. Add permadeath. Yeah, okay, you got it. Add phone numbers so we can start texting people instead of trading. Add a gun so we can... Oh, like text people on the phone instead of having to do the trade the text. Yeah, definitely. Phone message system. Same thing, another thing, which is red. Legendary talent. Give us codes. They want codes. I need your help, guys, to make one of the best gang in the future. Give access to console. They want console, bro. Protein fart. Crazy. All right. So... That's pretty much it for this video. I read some of you guys' suggestions. I made some myself. I talked about, you know, why the update's going to be delayed. And yeah, if you guys enjoy, make sure to like, subscribe. Um, if you guys want more Osiris content, I might be on Osiris here and there. I um, haven't really been playing too much. I'm already like A rank on there. And, you know, I've really just been chilling, playing other stuff and all that. I've been also grinding Mighty Omega. So I'm definitely going to be making some content on that game. And once Oscar updates, I'll most likely hop on Oscar for that update. And yeah, peace guys. Make sure to like, subscribe, and have a blessed day. We're on the road to 5k subscribers. Every sub means a lot. Peace.